guys we are back at it again we're here at hyundai here in gaithersburg maryland yes we decided to come look at cars up here too and this is the palisade y'all and when i say i am impressed like this is a 2021 but the 2022s are basically kind of similar oh look at that space down there too did you see it has usbs oh my gosh it does have a power outlet back here yeah it has a regular one and then every seat has its own usb oh every single one we got cup holders here two of them on the doors and then one on the bottom and then you got four back here and then yep this is awesome we we'll have to make sure we get the step as well That'll make it a lot easier. Of course, all the lights in the vehicle are like the bright blue ones. So, for example, okay. this is nice. <laughs> I mean, yeah. it's literally. This every... is what I was hoping to see. Yeah. Let's see the front. It's the best one right now. I had never thought about Hondas, y'all. <laughs> it is pretty nice. Like, I mean, it ha literally has everything that we want in a car. Even for the kids, I told y'all the shade, the uh, captain's seat. Because like, Maddie, she'll be able to climb back there. Her brothers will be right here. And then. This is nice. And it has the air vents up there. Never thought that I would <laughs> look into Hondas, but this right here, yeah, this is this is pretty nice. Um, I'm very impressed. <laughs> so we're here at Infinity now. So this is the Q50, QX50, excuse me, and this guy is nice. Like I said, if it had the third row, I probably would go with this. Ooh, look at that, it lights up. But it doesn't have third row back there, so that's out of the question. <sighs> this is so nice. I just love new car smells. I'm fortunate we do not have a single one. Wow. Do you know if you have the new Pathfinders? Pathfinders, we do. Can I take a peek in one of those? If yeah. No problem. Daddy's getting ready. <laughs> That's cool. And that way we won't have to hold her or him. They can just stand. So we are looking at strollers. And there's just so many to choose from, you guys. Like, so many. <laughs> he would love to have for the kids because we could put. The baby here, Tristan, and then Maddie can stand over there because it has the, um, I don't know if you guys saw, it has the stand right here where the kid can stand here. And this is about Upa Baby, Upa Baby, and it's the Visa. I like that. We are here at Bye Bye Baby. I guess you can hear me. But we're at Bye Bye Baby in Rockville. Because I think this is the only um, baby store in Maryland, I think. Because like I said, when we were here, we had Babies R Us, but then they shut down. So, <laughs> so yeah, it's so many to choose from, you guys. Like, Because we're just so used to Brytex, because that's what both our kids had. But now, you know, we want something that'd be convenient for all of the kids. Oh, this is so cute. Jeep has one. That's all like that. <laughs> it's so cute. That's huge, man. It's got a basket in the front. That's perfect for like um, Disney trips. and stuff. So that's why we are looking now because we want to decide which one because of course we'll want the car. Aww. We one that, um, or at least we want one that we can put from the stroller to the car seat and vice versa. But that has some room for, you know, Tristan when he doesn't feel like walking and all that. So, so much to choose from. 
<laughs> but I just miss being in a baby store, so it just feels good to just be here. <laughs> Feel free to share any suggestions down below of what you think would be best. That's cute. Please said by Contours. Looks comfy. <laughs> It's a material. <laughs> as long as we get the same brand car seat, mm -hmm. it should have clicked right here. Yeah, that would just make life so much easier. This one doesn't have the little ride along thing. Mm. So, did you guys like this one already? Yeah, <laughs> yeah this is nice. <laughs> Cause I felt, I felt in love with it when, when I first saw it. So. <laughs> it's the leather for me right here. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. I, I, this one, unfortunately, um, so the upper baby one, the first one that you guys saw, it does come with a bassinet. This one doesn't come with a bassinet, but it's still tough. Okay. Easier for you to get in and out of the car. Yeah. Easier for me to out of the car. Adjustable handlebar. Mm -hmm. and I'll just... Oh okay. snap! You can fold it that way too. Both. And it won't take up a lot of space either. Yeah, that'd slide right in on that. But you can you yeah. can still take off the chair, remove the chairs. Yeah. That would be more lighter. That's cool. Yeah, pretty much. Just gotta press this little last right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, that's you want to have two, three hundred. So that's about a thousand three altogether. But it's one of the best companies in the business. Wow. German company. <laughs> In German. <laughs> German and British. That's why I'm glad we're looking now because this is this is a lot. Cute. Oh. <laughs> I might get so emotional right now. Uh, yeah, so I'm glad we're looking now because we have a lot to decide on. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish looking around and I'll come back and hush. <laughs> it's been the round. <laughs> That's cute though. So we're downstairs. They have a downstairs here, y'all. So there's a stairs here. And we're looking at bassinets. That's where. Oh. <laughs> I'll put them to sleep real quick. The Mama Rue. But I think I've seen it in a different brand. Or is it by Four Moms? No, it's the Happy Baby where like they it's like the swaddle piece comes with it in here and then it does all this motion and stuff that's pretty cool <laughs> it's vibrating Ooh. <gasps> white sounds <laughs> you can't just listen to me no <laughs> that's true <laughs> white sounds <laughs> Both our kids slept in um, bassinets, but it was the three in one. So I had the attachment at the top and then the stuff at the bottom. Ooh, that's a good little room. <laughs> yeah, because the first couple of months he's going to be in our room. So, well, probably until we move to another house. <laughs> but Tristan wants him to sleep in his room so bad. I'm like, oh. Not right now, Tristan. When they get older, that's why I'm kind of glad that we're having another boy because they'll be able to share room and stuff. But he'll be with us for now. So no nursery right now, but like I said, we'll do like a shared baby area. So ah, so stuff. But yeah, so it's just a lot to look at and decide what we're going to get so yeah <laughs> parents parenthood is something else but it's cool how they have upstairs downstairs i've never been to yeah, i'm glad they, this is big yeah 
is what I wanted to see. Because from the outside, we were like, uh, it's a little too small. <laughs> but like I said, they have the steps. Right oh, you're going to need a comfort chair. Yeah, because our bed is not. Like, just like a cheap lighter, kind of how we have for Maddie and Tristan. Like that one? That's the same exact wood. <laughs> That's exactly because we have we had a pink one for Maddie, and then we bought we the, got the gray cushion. Yeah. They never fit right. No. Mm -mm. Uh, yeah, because me trying to rock him in our bed is not gonna. It's not gonna cut it. Welcome to DC. We ain't going nowhere. Welcome to DC. So we are in our hotel room. So we are here at the Grand Hyatt in DC. So here is our mirror. Ooh, hey, Belly. <laughs> And then coffee maker area. Ooh, that's a, that's a, okay, I'm gonna say fridge. It's a fridge. And then here is the bathroom. It is nice. It has a tub. I mean, you could sit in there if you want to. But it's not like a jacuzzi tub like the other suites and stuff. And then there's the towels and lotion and stuff. And then there's the TV. <laughs> Welcome, Matthew Wise. <laughs> and the table, you can do work. And there's the big guy. <laughs> and then. <laughs> yes, I left my computer at home. <laughs> and there's the bed. In the view, Washington D.C. Like we are literally in the middle of everything. Like the monument, I think it's down this way. That's not it right there, but the monument's down there. Um, she said that we're near the Verizon Center, and just everything is here. And then the metro is underneath the hotel, so that's good. If we want to go somewhere, we don't feel like walking. This is nice. Oh yes, lightning, come on. So this kind of reminds me of like the one we stayed in in Austin, except the pictures and stuff had rock and roll. <laughs> you know, Austin's known for the music and stuff. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because remember. The bed, the bed had that same type of head. Yeah. And then the lights on the bed. Yeah. So yeah, all the heights we've stayed in so far have been very nice, so. I think that's what my team is doing. But yeah, so we are here doing like a mini baby moon, I guess. We left the kids with grandma and grandpa's to have some time together and enjoy being home, away from home. And, you know, haven't been to DC in like forever. I don't even, when's the last time we came to DC? I can't even remember. You know, we stayed outside of Baltimore, so we're always in Baltimore and everything but it is so nice so we got in tuesday yeah so we got in tuesday and it wasn't bad at all we had a layover and oh lord now the sun's gone <laughs> the sun will come out tomorrow so yeah we got in tuesday and the flight wasn't bad um we had a layover in atlanta and then we went to um flew into bwi well, we just been resting. It's, I'm still kind of tired. <laughs> like, I don't know what it is. Like, I don't know if it's the time change. I mean, we're only an hour ahead. Like, I don't think so. But I'm tired and just here about to lay down. So, but we have reservations tonight for dinner, and then tomorrow we'll do like more outdoor stuff and everything. 
I mean, you should do it today because it's 60 degrees. So. <laughs> and tomorrow's gonna be a little colder, but yeah. So we are here in DC and just having time together, time alone and stuff. And on the way here, we stopped at, you know, Babies R Us, not Babies R Us, Baby, Bye Bye Baby to look at baby stuff and look at cars and everything because we just need to find something and figure out what we're gonna do because this shortage and chip issue is just, it's stressful at this point, so. Yeah, but just wanna let you guys know we made it safely and we're about to rest because as you guys see, I'm getting tired. So, yeah. Oh, oh, I'm glad they still have the lights up here. Yeah, that is pretty. Good. Yeah. It's Chanel. Cool. Tiffany and Co. We are out here in these DC streets and we are here at City Center. I cannot believe, I was just telling him like, as many times as I've been to DC, visited DC, lived near DC, when I lived, you know, closer to DC, I cannot believe I've never been down here before to the City Center area. I've always seen it like online, like the light area. I have it on my phone, I'll add it on here where they have the lights and stuff. It is so pretty to see it in person. So, yeah, but we're just over here, window shopping, just looking and everything, because it is so nice. I have my favorite stores over here, and I just love it here. <laughs> now, living here, I, I wouldn't live in DC, but just to like come down and see it, and the weather is really nice. Like, like I'm starting to get hot <laughs> a little bit. My, I my brown jacket on. Should have brought, should have brought my smaller jacket. But oh, so it's the hotel. Okay, it's so nice. Look at this, y'all. This is the Conrad right here. Yeah, so we're on. We're like two blocks down. Two blocks down. And then here, bless you. Uh -huh. So, so yeah, we're just out here walking around. And then we're gonna go back and get ready for dinner. So nice. Everything has been so good so far. So we have the chicken and waffles cutting right now. And then the sweet potatoes. We've seen this with collard greens. That'll probably come out with a steak. Okay. <laughs> you know, as you see me, it's dark in here. But yeah, this place is so, so, so good. I know when I tell y'all, so I'm just picking up the collard greens. <laughs> so we got collard greens. Aw, oh, thank you. This place is so good. Like I said, it's called Suckatash. I'll leave right here, link below. And they got found it for us because I told them to pick out something. And I didn't even think about southern, you know, soul food and stuff. And he picked this out, and y'all, everything has been good. <laughs> has everything. You too, Mom. Yeah. And y'all know he loves to eat, so he says it's good. It's good. Like we had, so we had the starters, which was the cornbread, 
Um, it was like little muffin cakes and we had like a little slice of toast bread. And then we had double eggs with green onions at the bottom. So good, y'all. So good. And then we had our oh my god, we had so much stuff. Feels me feels like we have so much stuff. Uh, we had the devil eggs, the cornbread. We just ate our shrimp and grits, which was, which was absolutely delicious. Now we're about to get our chicken and waffles. So, all right, y'all, let me eat because this food is just too good. So, I'll come back and tell y'all all about it. Look how fancy this place is on the outside. Like, that is insane. There, you want to get the menu? People always like to see that menu. Okay. So, here he is. Here's the menu right here. Ooh. So this is That's the chicken and waffles yep. right there. Uh-huh. In the oh y'all, those wings. Oh my gosh. I just cannot believe how good those wings were. <laughs> okay, happy hour. And then there's the menu. So we had oh, yeah, we'll be on the next page okay. right here. Taste of the South. Yes, it is the one we had. The uh, ribeye, chicken waffles, shrimp and grits. And then the devil eggs we're telling you about, so good. So yeah, if you live in DC or come to DC, please get your life and come and visit this place. Because <laughs> it was really good. Yo, when I say I am stuffed, like literally that was like a five, <laughs> like a 10 course of meal because after we ate everything, they brought something to us and it was absolutely dish. I should've got a picture of that on my phone. Uh, on the camera. Cause I've never seen a southern soul food place look that fancy. Like, yeah. So y'all gotta come and get y'all life. But anyways, I am full. Look at this belly. You see the belly? You see the belly? <laughs> <laughs> I look like a piece of, <laughs> I look like a green glove. It's my leather dress. I'm gonna show you an OOTN outfit of night. So I have on this leather dress that I bought from Zara. I ordered it offline like um, two months ago and the belly fits around it. <laughs> and then I have my brown coat on because it was warm earlier, but now it's feeling a little cold and stuff. So, but yeah. That restaurant was really good. Thank you, babe, for finding for us. <laughs> so now we're about to head back to our hotel and get cleaned up and lay our butts down because I'm tired. I'm sure he's tired. And we're kid free. <laughs> See, if I wasn't pregnant, we'd be probably going to some lounge or club. <laughs> no, <it wasn't. laughs> right? I'm just kidding. I can't hang like I used to anymore. Like I don't drink anymore. Even before I was pregnant, y'all stopped drinking. So I can't even hang like I used to anymore, y'all. Again, no. So but yeah. So we're about to head back to the hotel. So I'll catch you guys in there. <laughs> Hi. <laughs>